Robots. There's too many of them. Too Many Robots was released by Paragon Books Limited in Bath for their My Stuff range of books and activity sets. Originally, the series seems to have been called Boy Stuff, but I can only imagine that the March of Progress made them change that. I know it's likely that they changed the name to avoid being called sexist, but honestly, I don't think many girls would have been bothered by being left out of this one. Seriously, out of all the reviews on Amazon, all but one of them is one star. And the only other one is two stars, which I have to assume was some kind of dreadful mistake. Weirdly, the only other items in the range these days are My Stuff Paper Planes, My Stuff My Book My Rules, and My Stuff Farts A Noisy Guide. Classy. Very alright, although those look very much like they're around at teenage, like, why not teenagers? Like teenage. like very young, um, well, sort of lad stereotypically there. We'll have a look at the, uh, doesn't have like an age rating as far as I can tell. No, it doesn't seem to. Apparently it costs £12 though. As you might see a little later on, it's not worth £12. I believe my mum got me this for Christmas this year from the works for about, I don't know, five odd quid, I would hope. If she paid £12, mum, you got ripped off. Christmas present, you bastard! Oh yeah. To clarify, it doesn't come in all these pieces. It actually comes in... Yeah, there's one of them on the floor. That doesn't matter, it's fine. It comes in sprue. Over 50 moving parts. That's a lie. Okay. Oh, yeah. Because you got... Let's just give us a count up here. Two, three, four... I've just dropped it. One. Yep. Five. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Fifteen. What was we dropped on four? Yeah, 15 moving parts. And then these are the bits that like tie the limbs together. So, like when you put, so you see, you've see got all these little keyhole design things on them. Yeah, yeah, you put it in there and uh, you, spin it, you spin it around. And that's supposedly supposed to keep it together. It doesn't work, to clarify. The gimmick here is, is the other thing it says is that you can make over 9,000. No jokes. Over 9,000 different robots. Bullshit. But the way they get around that is they've got this side's yellow and that side's grey. That means it's a different robot. The heads, are, there are two options for. You've got this kind of head, which, as you probably think, is huge yeah. and can be used as a body to substitute and comes in this shape in either orange or blue. Well, this one or this is one. much better. It's a tiny little baby head for a robot. It's lovely. And so those are the two head options. Uh, and then as far as leg options, you have two. You have this in either blue or orange, which is just little legs that once stuck on the bottom of the robot will spin like this. Um, and then you've got this, which is like, you know, caterpillar tracks that you have on a tank. The plastic ties, the little cardboard toys hold together, they break fucking easily as shit, like this here. It's in 14 pieces. Um, 14? No, that was a bit of an exaggeration. Yeah. It's yeah, fine, so maybe. we're going to try and make just, some... Just maybe. Try and make some I'm already things. trying to make something. Alright then, well let's I've fucking... I've been sat here trying to make something too, right? It's, it's, this entire it's time. It's really not very simple, to be honest. Three year olds. So basically, three or under, as I expect to do this, presumably without supervision, otherwise you're a fucking monster. I wouldn't give this to a child unless I didn't like the child very much. I don't know, these are awful. Yeah, they just... You know I mean? <laughs> that was that a clean one before you put it yeah. in there. That's, that was like in a few seconds. You have to be very delicate with them, and even then... But how do you attach the head to the body then? Because right. Because you put this yeah, thing here, right. and put the other bit in thick, okay, and so twist, but This no. is part of the issue, 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 is that, for instance, with this, if I was then to use this body and attach it to it, there's two different ways of doing it on the body, two different edges. You've got the middle bit here, which is actually um, one closed, not got any flap access to it. You have to close it before you attach the head. Or you can attach it to that side, where you can technically put the thing in first, but you're supposed to seal it with this top flap. So either way, you've got to try and get one of these ties in with 
With baby fingers, it might be easier to get in there, I suppose. The pieces of this set do not fit together very well at all, and most of the time the keys will rip instead of turning with the rest of the body parts. Although the actual print quality on the pieces is quite good, the chances of them standing up to being put together more than once is slim at best. The fiddliness of the construction combined with the flimsiness of the keys means you're more likely to get frustrated and destroy the robots yourself than you are to actually have any robot fights as the book suggests. The worst part of it is that this whole set should have cost you £12 if bought new, which it is completely not worth in any regard. The activity book is okay, it's got like different robots that you can build um, and you're supposed to fight them and then have like a tournament and at the end there's a leaderboard. Which is really awesome. Yeah, and as you were saying... And I would really enjoy that, yeah. just the quality of the build. If, it, if you could good. actually make the robots repeatedly, yeah. or at all, in fact, and battle them out, that would be quite interesting, but you can't. And a kid would have the patience for this. No, kid's patience lasts five minutes. Yeah. I mean, I as a kid would not have had the patience for it. I made a robot. It's This is hand Android. See? He stands on his hands. He's a hand robot. I win. Out of 9,000 robots, what, uh, what do you give this? Zero. Because I can't make a single robot. That's uh, one. Yeah. I'll give it two. Not because I made two robots. I made one. Not this one. This one doesn't count. I made one the other day. Um, in preparation for this review. But I also am giving it one because the activity book has some stuff that children might be interested in. And as this is aimed at them, that's fair enough. I'm done. Bye-bye. See yeah. you later. Yeah. Yeah, we're done. Yeah. <laughs>